All right, Hawkins here with Chicken Hawk Farm Set, and today we have this. It's the cheapest, I guess, skid steer slash tractor clamp on forks, or not clamp on forks, actual forks that I could find on Amazon. I looked for these things locally. Tractor Supply didn't have them, Royal King didn't have them. There was a couple other places locally. Nobody had these in stock for some reason for uh, like a mid-sized tractor. So, turned to Amazon. I actually found these for a whole lot cheaper. I think it was like $300, $200 cheaper than what I was finding them locally. And it's got a lot more uh, things that it can do. So let's pop it open and see if it's all that uh, the ad said it was gonna be. The forks, uh, they did come separate. They're right here. Okay, yeah. They are definitely heavy. So they got that part in check. And we got a release here, so that all looks good. They said they were set separate. This should be the back, the actual uh, attachment part was on the tractor and these go on there. And it said these were, I think these are supposed to be like 50, 60 pounds, 70 pounds piece, something like that. But I wanna see how this thing looks. So let's crack it open and take a look at it. Uh, the shipping on this thing as well was actually a lot quicker than I thought it was gonna be. Uh, I think it was like a week or two and I had this thing to me all the way from Texas, free shipping. I paid, what was it? Eight, I don't know, I'll put it somewhere on the screen and let y'all know what exactly I paid. I'll try to put it over here or something from the listing. Cause I did have at the time a $50 off coupon or a clickable coupon, which was really nice. So, all right. Probably one of the bigger unboxings I've done on here. So far, everything looks good. I think this is supposed to be around 150 pounds as well. Uh, I was able to find some bigger forks locally, but I didn't want to go with the bigger fork because a bigger fork that's more heavy duty, say like a 4,000 or 6,000 pound fork, the fork itself is going to weigh a lot more. I have a 25 horsepower uh, from Roll King, it's an RK25, and its lift capacity, I think it's around like 1,200 pounds, something like that. So I'll put that somewhere too, maybe. And if you go with a heavier duty fork, well, your forks themselves weigh more and that's left, less you can lift now. So these, I believe, were 2,500 pound rated. So a lot more than my tractor can even lift. All right, Let's see if I can cut down this side. And I say this too, the guy that delivered this, this is right where they put it. I really appreciate that. They didn't lay it down, they didn't put it somewhere awkward. Right. We even got some foam inserts here. Uh, well, we got some paperwork, collars. All right. So this thing is definitely heavy. Now, if you can see this, this is one of the things I really liked about this one over some of the other local ones. Is right here, it's supposed to be able to accept the two inch receiver. We're going to try that out. So, if you want to put a carry all in the front, you got a, a winch that's hooked to a receiver mount. Um, hell, you want to put your two inch receiver on there and drag your, um, it's called like your trailers around or anything like that. You can do all that with that. Uh, these accept hay spears. So, not only is it forks, I can pop those forks off in theory, put my hay spears on here, and now I got a front hay spear. Uh, I was multitasker, I mean, you can't beat that. So, like I said, I'm gonna start messing with this. I'll get it flipped around and see how it looks. We'll take a closer look. Oh, don't drop it. All right, let me bring you guys in for a closer look. All right, well, here we are on a closer look. Like I said, we got the two inch receiver there. We're gonna check that out here in a minute, see if it works. Uh, those are nice. Got a big main fork there. A lot of people I see just running with two, so I mean, that's even a possibility. Uh, <laughs> the hay bells are the, the round bells around here are uh, more than my tractor can lift though, so. It's not going to do me a lot of good with those yet, but on um, partial bells or any smaller ones, and I'm sure there's probably a lot of other things I can do with that. 
uh, I think that's gonna come in pretty handy here and there and overall though this thing I mean y'all tell me what these welds are <laughs> I'm not a, a welder but like I said uh, I'm only gonna be lifting about a thousand pounds with this thing so hopefully it's gonna hold up nicely there is a lot of metal there uh, on the back like I said it's a good sear attach that looks uh, it's reinforced and looks pretty nice yeah the, I mean there's a there's some splatter and stuff I know that's not the greatest but you know this thing's gonna be outside getting used and beat up and for a couple hundred bucks off I think it was they like said I think 750 or 850 and everything else was around 11 or 1200 uh, there's the forks guess we got they go into that little lip on the bottom and I really like how these forks because even on some of the cheap ones you find on there the rail, the forks didn't move. Now, that's one thing I did want. I wanted the ability to, to move the forks around. And it looks like I might be able to make them almost touching so get uh, more lift out of there. But All right, I'm going to go get the tractor, uh, take the bucket off, and bring that thing around, and we'll clip these on see how it works out. forks on there's this lip right here so you can take that bottom and get it on that rail just only took a second to figure that out but If you can hear me over the tractor, I guess I could turn it off. Hold on. All right. Here we are. Uh, everything linked up good. Nice and tight. No issues linking up there. Like I said, we're going to go see about picking something up. Uh, I don't know if I should start out with just something really heavy and see what happens. Or I could just do what I normally need to do. It's one of those uh, questions, I guess, right? But uh, right now I'm gonna go grab a two inch uh, receiver, I think it is, a two inch, two inch piece, and see if it'll uh, fit in there and see what happens. All right, we got a little two inch piece here, yeah. And with the two inch ball in there, we're just gonna see if this fits. All right, well, there you go. So we can put whatever two inch receiver accessory we got here. And yeah, so far this seems like it's living up to everything it should be. Very happy with this. And like I said, for hundreds less. So next is the lift test. We're going to go uh, pick something up and see how it does. Be right back. If anyone's interested, uh, the length of these forks are, well, if it focus, right at 42 inches. So it's another thing I liked about this set. You didn't get the short forks, even though it was low capacity. Yeah, pretty sweet. All right, let's start out. Let's see about moving some logs. It's gonna be a little challenging with one hand, but we'll get it done.
All right, let's get one of these big logs here. A tree again. All right, I'm gonna try this a couple more times. We'll see what's going on. All right, we got another big one here. Didn't want to get lifted up, I guess. Try something else. All right, let's lift something that uh, someone would buy a pallet for to lift. Pallets. So we got some pallets right there. There we go. Now we can move this wherever we want. I'm just gonna put it right back where it was. All right, well, here's my last lift for the video. I don't know how heavy this is, but those gates are not light. They're every bit of 50, 60 pounds a piece. Uh, you're looking one, two, three, Probably three, four, five hundred pounds easy on there. Uh, no issues so far. Uh, having way too much fun with this thing. Uh, I'll do an update video, I guess, in about a year or if something breaks. So make sure you like, share, and subscribe to the channel to see. But as of right now, I'm highly recommending these. And I even actually got a couple friends that I'm going to go ahead and uh, tell them about these. Because for that price, the shipping was a couple weeks. Uh, not a couple months or more like some other places yeah it does off of amazon so you know you kind of got the amazon guarantee most people these days do use it and it's got the two inch ball receiver or the two inch receiver plus you can put the hay spears on there i mean it just that's awesome so all right well i'm gonna leave it with that really like these things y'all have a good one